Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Heart and Soul Cooking and Crafting. Today I am doing a recipe for my homemade potato bread. The full recipe will be on my blog. And yes, my cat has decided to show up on my table. <laughs> um, now, what you're going to need is leftover mashed potatoes eggs, half and half with melted butter, a packet of yeast that is bloomed. You're going to need garlic powder, onion powder, black pepper, a little bit of salt, and you're good to go. So right now in my bowl, I have the potatoes, eggs, seasonings, getting ready to mix that in. Now you can also use those store-bought potatoes that are in Walmart or EGB or whatever store you go to. Add your milk and your butter. Now add your yeast. And then start sifting in your flour. Now the amount of flour depends on temperature in the house. And yes, my cats are playing in the background. And with this bread, you can do anything you want with it. You can make a whole loaf of bread, or you can make dinner rolls, buns, whatever you want. Now, at this point, you're going to need to switch from the whisk to a spoon. But you can do this in a stand mixer. So, that'll make life easier for you. But for me, I like doing it this way because once I get it to a certain point, I can actually mix it with my hand. That way I get an idea of how the dough feels and if I need more flour or not. Alright, let me mix this up and I will be right back. Okay, now it's to the point where I need to use my hands. So, as you can see, it's starting to get to a dough point. So, let me do that and I will be back. Alright everybody, take a look at this gorgeous dough. All nice. Now, just put a little bit of oil over this so it doesn't dry out. Leave it in your bowl, cover it, and let it rise for about two hours. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe, press that like button, press that notification button, and don't forget to share the video. 
You could also follow us on TikTok at Soul Zelda. And we'll, I will be doing a part two on this so that you can see me bake it off. Alrighty, we'll see you in the next one.